Welcome back. We're on page 45, lesson 10. These are consonant digraphs. There are two consonant letters, two letters that have only one sound. Interesting, right? Consonant digraphs can come at the beginning or end of a word. You never mark a digraph long or short. You simply underline them when you are decoding. And these consonant digraphs are TH, as in thumb, WH, as in will, SH, as in shoe, and CH, as in church. You'll notice church has two digraphs, one in the beginning, one at the end, and the UR in the middle is an R controlled vowel. Very interesting word. Okay, now let's turn to page 46. Of course, it couldn't be that simple. Each consonant digraph can either be hard or soft. So let's look at the hard and soft of TH. Page 46 in the directions. The TH in thorn and bath have the soft sound of TH, while the TH in that and bathe have the hard sound of TH. So say each word twice so you can hear the difference. You know all of these words, and if you don't, you know how to decode them. The first one is thumb. So you underline the T, and that's soft, isn't it? And thin, and them, and father, and those. And you will be able to hear the hard and the soft, okay? Turning to page 47, we have consonant digraph WH, like in will. So you'll say the word twice and then underline the WH. And on this page, there are 30 WH consonant digraph sounds. And remember, they are not vowels. These are consonants. And much like our blends, they stick together. Another one is on page 48, the digraph SH, like in ship, shade, shell, blush, shaker, number 10, trash, keeping in mind that digraphs can come at the beginning or the end of a word. Practice these as you will. You can pause, practice, turn back on, and we're on page 49, consonant digraph CH. Chair begins with the sound representing CH. Say each word twice and underline the CH. So we have number one, chill, number two, child, number three, match, the CH is at the end of match, and church is one of these where the CH is at the beginning and the end of the word. So that was page 49. You can pause, and when you're ready, we'll go to page 50, which is the consonant digraph review. Page 50, directions. Say each word twice. Listen for a beginning, middle, or ending consonant digraph sound. Decode each word in the space provided. For example, number one is shade, and you will underline SH. The A will be long, and the E will be silent. Number two, the digraph is WH. The A will be long, and the E will be silent. To sound out number two, you would say A, L, well. Always starting with the first vowel and a word to sound it out. So go ahead and practice page 50, and um, then we'll get on to lesson 11.